Hello everyone, my name is Seema and welcome to this video. What are we discussing today? The topic for today's discussion is being in the flow is the root cause of all success. What's being in the flow means, right? See, when we are in, in the flow, means we are one with what we are doing and we lose sense of time and our surroundings. That is when we are in the flow. When does that happen? That happens when we are pursuing something that we really like. It could be painting. It could be cooking. It could be driving. It could uh, driving on a nice clean road, right? In the um, in nature, it, it's very meditative. Hiking is another option. Gardening could be one. So a lot of uh, creative outlets, even gaming, people who are gamers, they lose themselves when they're doing the process, right? So when you lose yourself, you lose a sense of surrounding, you lose sense of time. And you know, when you're doing it, you you'd feel you just started it and, and you look at the clock and a few hours have gone by and you're not even aware of it. That is when you're in the flow. You become one with what you're doing. And when that happens, that is success. You are arresting time, you will also remain younger like that. Because stress causes a lot of health issues. When we learn to become in the flow, not just with an activity, you can start with an activity, but then with time, you become like that, you will have a rested time. That is how the monks and the um, old siddhas in India would, would, would live by. They... Even doing a chore feels like that to them. Whether you make them pick bricks from one end and put in another end, they still feel the same thing because they have learned to live life at, like that. They are in the flow. So it's everything is like relaxed and calm and nothing feels like uh, that throws them off. No, no, no word throws them off. Nobody's uh, mistreatment throws them off. Um, nothing, nothing really matters. That is when they have overcome themselves. So how do you go about doing this? I would say practice with something that you like to do and something that doesn't feel too difficult. Take a part if you feel like. Take a cooking if, if that is something of interest to you or just go hike up a mountain or something or on the trails and see how how that feels if you have uh, if you're in the moment you will learn to appreciate what is in front of you rather than oh what is my child doing right now what must my husband have for lunch oh i didn't do this uh, i need to make a phone call you know all those thoughts will just leave you and you will um, enjoy the wildflowers uh, on the trails or you might uh, appreciate a brush stroke that you make on your painting or be like uh, so happy to see how a certain color looks on the canvas and um, that is that is where the beauty of life is not everything can be associated with money and wealth. What is money and wealth giving you if it causes a lot of stress for you, a lot of disease, a lot of mental torture? Is that any good? You have to learn to stop your mind and be in the flow with various activities that you can take up that you like. That is the way to find the divinity in yourself or find God. Running like a, a mad person pursuing things that someone else told you to do is in the end not so liberating. We are here in this 
on this earth to find an our divine be our divine self that is the end goal but we get lost in making one home after another we want 10 houses we want bigger houses we want bigger cars we want more bank balance we want more and more people surrounding us we want to wear a lot of gold one necklace is less we have at least 10 if you can um, more in the locker bank lock <laughs> i mean you name it and people have desires they are so lost in the material world that um, they forget the real reason of why they are here the happiness that one gets from being of service without expecting something back from someone has immense value. Those who publish that they, they gave so much in charity or they're helping so many people are actually doing a disservice because they are not doing service for people out of love and care they're not in the flow there right they are doing because they want to look pretty in front of people the ones who are in the flow will will help even without thinking a small gesture here a small gesture there a kind word there a smile there a little tip there a little something there a little opportunity for somebody they can create a little like monthly thing that they could do for someone and they don't even talk about it because they are in the flow of 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 giving in and that's how they receive but if you twist the universe's hand and say look i gave thousand dollars in charity i better get back more than that that's the universe not going to give that because that is now has not been integrated into you your, your subconscious doesn't know that. Your mind is controlling everything at that point. And being in flow means the mind has to be put away and you let life flow through you. I don't say what I don't practice and it has taken a while to get to that point and it, it will be like that for a lot of people who who go through it but keep your desires strong and you don't have to really leave the world and go into a monastery to become uh, to have this kind of uh, mental state you can achieve it even in your home living your normal life in this modern world and um, I have done that and it is it is doable and that is why I say that. All you need to do is take up certain practices initially. Through the practices, gain some sort of mastery over some time in your life. And then increase the activities where your day is filled with such activities where you feel you're in the flow. And then you will eventually see that with time... And it's not one week or two weeks, but with time and with practice, that is how your life will become. That is who you will become. And it's like a lake. You know, have you ever seen a pond or a lake when you, when it's still, you can see your reflection in it. But when it's like moving, then there is, you cannot really see anything in it, right? So when you can see your own reflection in your still mind, your all your actions will be positive. All your actions will be towards the right direction. You will be guided in the right direction. And your achievement will be much more too. And your requirement for achievement will be different too. It's not that you will, um, you know, I need a $10,000 bonus is not what you're looking at or 100,000 bonus is not, not your requirement. It might be um, a delicious meal, you know. Maybe you want to cook something very delicious. It would be a requirement. Oh, I wish I could eat this for lunch today. And 
the best possible food will uh, will will show up on your table so your requirements will change as you progress through certain steps in your life and um, you will achieve a lot of peace and in that peace and calmness think of the right decisions for yourself and your family and be able to avoid a lot of obstructions in, of this world it will not matter to you it will not um, make any sense to you you will be at peace uh, you will be one with the divine and uh, again that is how I we have taken birth in this world so I am going to do a, a four part series of where I go and explain uh, in the videos of the four phases that make a spiritually awakened person um, and uh, in order to do those it was very important that you listen to the two videos that I posted this one and the one before it and um, only when we can learn to unlearn which was the topic for the last video and when we come in the flow will we be able to achieve becoming spiritually awakened and that is when we become the divine we are the divine walking on this earth so please stay tuned uh, for those four phases of videos that i'll post and hopefully it will be helpful for you so you can identify where you see yourself in the four phases and how to get to the next step or to identify uh, how you would proceed into the final stage of becoming spiritually awakened hope this was helpful thanks for watching